Hey guys, what's up? It's Jay. I'm in the VIP Celebrity Lounge and I'm here with Howie Day. Howie, how are you? Doing all right. Doing all right. Thank you very much for being on the show. Your album, Stop All the World Now, is out right now. Your single, Collide, it's huge. But I want to go back to like where you came from. You're from Bangor, Maine. How did you get started in music? Oh, geez. Playing uh, every available gig possible for a while. You know, I don't know. Basically, all my friends made the basketball team and I didn't, so... I started playing music pretty young. My mom bought a, uh, a piano at, a, at an auction or something. And I just sort of picked up on it and was into it and went from there. And you started playing the, the guitar later in life. Like you went and got a, uh, your father bought you a guitar or something and then it evolved from there. Then you started singing when you were like 15, right? Well, I think when you turn like 13, all of a sudden the piano is kind of a wuss instrument. Right, right. Although you learn to appreciate it later. But uh, yeah, I wanted to play electric guitar and dad sort of hooked that up for me at 13 and I don't know, it was, it, I think any instrument is really easy to learn after you've learned how to play the piano. So tell me about the first gig you ever did, what, what was that like? Um, scary. I think, I think every kid you know, starts off playing and writing and, and singing sort of on your own and uh, the first time you have to do it in front of people it's a little freaky. So. That was my first gig, you know, it was, it was, it was freaky. And it's all really personal stuff because you write your own music, correct? I do, yeah. Yep. Now, do you have anything against the artists that don't write their own music? Do you think that they're less of artists or, or are you kind of like neutral about it? No, I think Britney Spears is great. You know, she writes some, I mean, uh, her people that... <laughs> <laughs> snap. <laughs> snap. Oh, oh. Um, no, I actually, you know, I'm a fan of people that don't write their own stuff. Just because some, you know, Frank Sinatra didn't write a lot of his own songs. And I think he's pretty cool, so... I don't point any fingers, you know, I'm just, I'm into whatever, so. Now, Howie, your album's called Stop All the World Now. What, what is that title? What's that about? It came down to, like, I had, a, I had like, a 24-hour period to figure out what am I going to name my album. And uh, so I did what any good artist would do, and I listened through the album for, like, a, a, a lyric that sounded like an album title. So that was what stuck out to me. It was a, and it worked. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's a little long, really. That's what I thought today. I was I like, I just called it "Stop." That would have been so more, like, so much more Peter Gabriel and so cool. But uh, you know, I, I think the title works, though. I think people are still digging the album. Now, "Collide" is like a huge song. You, you've been successful before this, but this song is really propelling you onto the national stage. What has that been like? That that change? Oh, it's been it's been interesting. You know, I get noticed more walking down the street, which uh, which is sometimes flattering and sometimes annoying, but that's how it goes. When's the most annoying time? The most annoying time, uh, I think, is when you're actually chewing at dinner and somebody comes up and says, well, I can have a picture with you. Have you ever been taking a pee? You're like, whoa, whoa, whoa. yeah, I have, I have been, actually. I, I've, had, I've been standing at the urinal and had the guy next to me kind of be like, hey, are you Howie Day? <laughs> and I'm like, and I'm like uh, I have to go wash my hands right now. Stop looking at my... <laughs> Stop trying to check out my junk. <laughs> Tell me a little bit about the video. I watched the video. It's a great video. It's very simple, but it, it like tells the story. What's the story about? Well, the original idea behind it was, uh, I th which I think a lot of people can relate with, is that that moment when you know you've been with somebody for a long time, and whether you're going off to college or you're moving away or, or whatever it is, or maybe you're just going off on a three-day trip to summer camp or something. I don't know. But uh, it's that, you know, couples kind of having to say goodbye, at least for a little while. And uh, that was the idea behind it. Well, let's check out the video. Here's Howie Day's hit song, Collide. <laughs> 